what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash today is december 1st and i'm gonna be trying my best my very best to upload every single day this month or i don't know about sundays but I want to do vlogmas this year i'm gonna try my best a lot of you guys wanted to see it and i'm gonna do like a sit down video today something really simple because tomorrow bath and body works is having their annual candle day event and i've been shopping candle day for i think i went consecutively two years now so this will be my third year so i'm gonna be taking you guys with me tomorrow but today we in the house and i want to be showing you guys some of the candles that i refuse to burn because they haven't come back yet or at least i haven't seen them and i've never been able to get like a backup and i'm just going to show you some of my top favorite candles i try to pick 10 but there's like a little bit over 10 here um but i just want to share that with you so get a drink grab a snack comment down below what your scent of the day is today i'm actually wearing this is actually the new Kaali Vanilla Royale Sugared Patchouli. I decided to pick this out because there is a candle that I'm going to be showing you guys today that actually smells very similar and it's from Bath and Body Works to this Kaali fragrance right here. It's very, very similar. So this is my scent of the day. This is the newer fragrance. It's called Vanilla Sir Absolute. And these are the notes. It has golden rum, creme brulee, brown sugar, royal oud, and sugared patchouli. A lot of people, if you haven't seen my review, views on it i spoke about how many people actually had reservations about this fragrance some people like it some people don't this fragrance was super anticipated by many people because it was supposed to smell very similar to the vanilla 28 in my opinion if you're loving a vanilla 28 this is not the same it is nice to me but again like i said there's a candle that i want to tell you guys about that it smells exactly like and um yeah this fragrance is really nice but again i feel like this is one of those things that i would not recommend blind buying and i do feel that you'd be better off smelling it before you get it yeah so i hope you dropped your sotd down in the comments below um and before we get into the candles i wanted to show you guys i did this on my community tab i got <laughs> i got mrs Potts. so um, I actually showed this in my last vlog, me going to pick it up, but then I decided to leave it because I was like, she $30, and I was like, do I really want to spend $30 on this right now? But you know what? I am a huge Beauty and the Beast fan, and one of you guys actually commented on my community tab that after hearing me talk about it, um, they went to go finish watching it because they never really finished watching the whole thing. So I advise you to check out Beauty and the Beast, okay? Because that movie... I don't know what it is like it's a love story for a lifetime like would i marry a beast no but if he was going to turn into the prince that the beast turned into baby maybe okay but that movie sometimes has me in tears it's so good so mrs pox is here she's really really cute i don't know what it is with me and like these mugs and stuff lately i've just been so into them it matches my mug i've been talking about this too much now but chip he's so cute he's on the little end i collect mugs but it has to be a certain type of mug like you can't just give me any mug like i really love it has to be unique okay so anyways let's get into some of the candles oh and i lied i'm actually wearing wrapped in vanilla too from bath and body works i don't smell it that much when i spray it all over but it's also good i wore it last night to bed wrapped in vanilla is really good y'all go get it ask for it put it on your christmas list it's good all right so boom candle number one i'm just gonna grab one these are candles like i said i have not burned them before because i just love them so much i am a candle sniffer my friends started doing it too where they pick up a candle that's randomly laying around they just smell it and close it like i don't know what that is about but if you do the same thing let me know in the comments because my friends started to do it because they see me do it not only with the candles but with my perfume too i'm like and i just put it back like i do that all the time i don't know i'm just a weirdo but here it is bow ties and bourbon now i like bourbon vanilla fragrances i like fragrances with vanilla i love fragrances with a nice woody note to it um i like masculine candles too those are also really nice i feel like they've just man the throw just fills the room so this has notes of it has a hint of bourbon fresh bergamot a splash of citrus um and this candle has just been one of my favorites i've had it since last year i think and it just smells so good and i feel like this is like one of those that i just i just don't want to use i don't know do you like that bourbon note oh 
baby it is very nice and again this is a unisex candle so if your man likes candles you know you want to give a gift for the holidays i don't know if this is going to be back for candle day but whenever it does come back use my video as reference for some like rare fine candles because this one's really really good i'm actually trying to get this video done before the sun goes down that's why i have the room light on today and if you guys want to know about my squishmallow somebody asked me about it in my last video this one right here her name is marcia and then this is carol Christmas Carol and then Marsha she's like really cute target for Marsha um, and Marshall's for Carol so this right here is one that I purchased in my last vlog if you haven't seen it I'll link it up top so you can check it out this is tipsy elf now tipsy elf I got it because um, I just like the name I feel like if I when I set up my uh, kind of like my bar station in my place I'm gonna have this candle sitting there I think I just like those unique names for candles and um but the thing is it's like a Christmassy candle so I don't know I think hopefully they come out with more like this but this one's really good the notes on this are Merry Vanilla Jolly Nutmeg and a sneaky elf with a heavy splash of rum not a little splash baby a heavy splash of rum so I went ahead and picked this up um, this will be available for candle day so if you are interested I would say get this one if you like the little name this I believe is a repackage and I believe it's been out before so you'll be able to get your hands on it tomorrow if you are shopping candle day whether you're gonna be shopping in store or online now this right here I believe these two are the same let me check the notes real quick while I'm here because <gasps> they are you guys okay so I guess this is gonna be two candles in one but I have refused to burn these because I just really like these candles I remember when this one came out this is called cookies and cream milkshake everyone was racing to get it like this was one of those like if you fought if you found it in, this was one of those if you found it in the store you picked up multiple okay because one the packaging is super cute it has a little Oreo on the side it is just one of those really nice chocolatey milkshake nice warm weather you just want to burn when you get home from a stressful day type of candle that's how i see it so cookies and cream milkshake is one of my favorites i don't know and you know what's funny i'm not a chocolate girl i don't normally go for chocolate if you get me ice cream you're like ash what do you want i like strawberry and i like vanilla i like cake batter and i do like coconut flakes and marshmallows in my ice cream i don't know if you whatever ice cream flavor you like let me know in the comments down below i love to hear about what you guys like and what you don't like so cookies and cream milkshake is one of my favorite candles that i just don't want to let go of and this one right here is called vanilla swirl brownie believe it or not they're the same exact candle just different packaging i'm gonna show you guys up close they look so different like you would definitely get fooled by seeing both of these with this different packaging because you'd be like you know they're different no baby they're the exact same just different um and something about the packaging being different makes you somehow think you're smelling two different things but they both have that same essence the notes are exactly the same chocolate cookie crumbles uh vanilla bean ice cream and chocolate drizzle this is like a chocolate candle heaven right here so i might as well burn one of them vanilla swirl brownie might be first because i just am obsessed with this packaging right here but these two are amazing if they brought these back for candle day i would have gone crazy i mean i don't know what they're gonna have for candle day and we'll see tomorrow but again this is definitely in my top 10 candles for sure this candle right here came out last year or maybe two years ago now i don't even remember this is called blue raspberry snow cone this is one of those things where i take out in the summer and i just smell it and smell it and i don't know why i don't burn it i always suggest getting a backup because honestly when you like something and it doesn't come back it just it, i don't like lacking things in my life so when i know i found some good and this is the only one i have it kind of makes me feel like i don't want to use it but eventually I'm gonna have to use them or not <laughs> I don't know but the notes on this one are blue raspberry syrup a hint of cherry scoop of shaved ice this brings me back to when I was in elementary school and we used to have these little shaved snow cone ice like they, they were like some trucks that used to come by and all of us would get like oh I always used to mix it so I would get the cherry and the blue raspberry mix oh my goodness and it would turn purple it was so like it just brings me back to the days when life was simple okay but this candle smells so accurate to a shaved snow cone so i just really like it um and the packaging is really cool the tie-dye i love this collection when it came out 
it was just a gem so this makes me really happy speaking of that collection that came out this was also part of that same line and this one is called rainbow confetti if you check out my highlights on instagram you'll actually see i have a candles highlight which actually showcases all the candles that i really love that i'm actually talking about today in this video this candle reminds me of my favorite cereal growing up which was fruit loops my mother gave me fruit loops every single day now that i look back i'm like mm -hmm, fruit loops probably not the best breakfast option but it was my favorite and i couldn't live without it um and now i haven't had fruit loops in ages now i can't even tell you when the last time i had that cereal was but it smells so accurate to a fruity cereal it smells like i opened the fruit loops box and i just stuck my head in there because and this candle is very strong. I've actually burned another one of them. So this is like my last one that I have left. The notes on this are rainbow sprinkles, vanilla cake, buttercream frosting, and fruity cereal crunch, which is absolutely spot on to the actual cereal crunch smell. Okay, and taste, honestly, but oh my god gosh it just is beautiful it's absolutely gorgeous one of my favorite candles for real like i don't know why i love fruity cereal candles my friends always tell me like i always like the more weird things like my mom she likes the floral candles and the you know the really like the, as long as it's some pretty citrusy fruity scent she likes it me i like gourmand scents i like things that remind me of food they have the french baguette candle that's coming out for candle day um you can pick that up i got it in my last video check it out if you haven't seen it i don't know what it is with me but it's just it's just who i am and i love that so this is her right here love it so much okay so far we did one two three four five six candles already and i have a few more that i'm going to show you so let's talk about this candle right here which actually i want to compare it to the new kaali scent and i talk about my cousin a lot because she is one of my favorite people in the world and she also shares the same passion that we all share here on this channel which is fragrance body care shopping girl talk whatever it is like she actually just has the same passion as me so we both ordered the kaali fragrance together and i she got it the day before i did so she kind of gave me the review and she was like girl i can't put my freaking um finger on it but i don't know she was like it smells like something i know so the next day she goes no what it smells like is this the uh smoked vanilla candle from bath and body works so i said oh my goodness let me see so the notes in this smoked vanilla candle are creamy vanilla, smoked sandalwood, and rich bourbon. And funny thing, in this, you know, perfume, it has none of those scents except the vanilla. But it really has that smoky, woody uh, scent to it that this fragrance embodies. It's very, and I won't say it's the exact same, but that the element of this candle, I'm telling you, really compares to this Kaali um, sugared patchouli so i wanted to show you guys that but this is one of my favorite candles this was actually one of those things that my cousin spoke highly of and told me to go get and i was like all right so when it came back i believe it was last year now this year really flew by like i don't know what it is about this year that just went by so quickly but then i think back because my birthday is in february so i was like hmm it feels like my birthday was so long ago but yet the year flew by and I was in Italy early this year. So I'm just like, hmm. like it feels like we're, I'm living in an alternate universe. Like one minute is flying by one minute. I'm like, yo, like that was a long time ago. It is time to get to the next year now because uh need a fresh start. OK, but like I told you, we're starting fresh today. So don't wait until January 1st. Today is the first day of the month. We're going to be starting fresh today okay so smoke vanilla is definitely a gem i love this candle and uh i don't want to use it because it smells all good <laughs> so i believe this candle is coming out again for candle day in a new packaging so if you see it you're gonna want to grab this one laundry day is my all-time favorite candle when i got laundry day and when i saw this was a thing i grabbed it i went crazy a lot of you guys know me uh when i talked about white t-shirt and i just talked about it and talked about it and talked about it until it actually came back which was awesome so laundry day is one of those candles for me that i just love from bath and body works this makes your whole house smell amazing if you love that fresh laundry scent this is going to be one of those things that you stock up on for candle day because it's going to be a great price the notes are fresh air crisp eucalyptus and soft lavender i love 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 
love this candle. Oh my goodness. I love clean people and things, okay? Clean houses. I don't know. I just want everything to smell fresh. Like, I even said this, like, if, you know, in a significant other, you know, I, th that's one of the things. If you're going to date me, you got to smell really, really good because I can't, I'm so sensitive to smells. So, I don't know. There was one person I met not too long ago and I had to tell them, like, you smell so fresh. Their clothes just smell so good. Um, I'm like, what do you wash your clothes with? Because it smelled like this candle. It was crazy. So, oh, laundry day is amazing. And if you don't have this one, baby, go get that. Get it. Like, if I tell you about any other candle today, laundry day is a gem. Okay? And you need this. All right. So, this candle right here is called Snowflakes and Citrus. The packaging reminds me of, like, a Cinderella story. I don't know what made me pick this up years ago i just got it and i've never ever used it because it's just so pretty if you love blue comment your favorite color down below my favorite color i just like neutral colors i don't know that's just me but um this candle is just very pretty and i don't know i've never seen a candle like this again from bath and body works and i've had this one for quite some time juicy citrus fresh spring water and sweet mango it is so good. <sighs> I feel like they just haven't come out with anything similar. This video, <laughs> filming this video makes me want to go to Bath & Body Works right now because I don't know. I just want to go see because sometimes you don't really notice things until you go look for real. Like sometimes I'm really in and out just getting what I went for. So I think I need to go look because I need to find something that's just like this because it smells amazing. Uh, also, someone commented and asked me how do I keep my braids so fresh. Uh, if I'm being quite honest with you, I get my braids done very often. I just left from getting them refreshed this morning. And what I do is I'll usually wash my hair and then I'll take out maybe just like the front and then redo just the front. And the front, it, it, it makes it look like my hair is just completely redone. But I did not sit there for that long. I sat there for maybe an hour and a half. And then I was out. And then, you know, we got some fresh braids, okay? So we have three more candles left. I'm not going to talk too long. But another gem of mine is called Warm Vanilla Sugar. I'm a vanilla girl. I always say this and I'm going to say it for life, okay? I hope so. Because this one lady, she said she got pregnant and she used to wear this expensive vanilla perfume like every day of her pregnancy. And then after she had the baby, she uh, can't wear the perfume anymore. Like it makes her sick. It, it's just like repulsive to her. So I'm like, oh, I will not wear vanilla perfumes during my pregnancy, whenever that is in the future. Because I don't want to be repulsed by my favorite scent note. Yeah, definitely not. So warm vanilla sugar in the candle. I was so excited when I saw this come out and I got this for candle day. I feel like if this comes out for candle day, everyone's gonna buy it up. So if you like this, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> I love it, I love it, I love it. It is like so amazing. I love when the body care scents come out in candles. It just adds to the fun, you know? My fave. Moving on, this is called New York. They don't, they haven't come out with another collection like this that actually talks about like the states. And I need that to happen. If they come up with a Florida and a New York candle, maybe some that say Jamaica too, I'm going to buy all three. New York is my birthplace. If y'all don't know, I was born in White Plains, New York. Okay. So this, honestly, the scent isn't my favorite. It's actually called Cherry Cheesecake. Okay. Cherry Cheesecake. Um, it has creamy vanilla, juicy red cherries, and graham cracker crust. Normally, I wouldn't pick up a candle that smells like this. It smells decent, but it's just not my favorite. I don't like cherry scents that much, but because it says New York, I had to get it. And once I saw it, I believe this was the only one in the store. So I picked it up and I ran and I've had it ever since. I believe I've had this candle for two years now, maybe three years now. I don't even know how long, but I just won't use it until I get another one because I don't know. I just don't have another candle that says New York. So for the last candle, we have Mary Cookie, which is going to be available for candle day as well. Mary Cookie is my favorite. It's actually over there, like on my little dresser over there. Um, I love Mary Cookie. Now I stocked up on this, so I have lots of Mary Cookie to go around. One thing about Mary Cookie, the throw is a strong 10 out of 10. It literally will, oh my goodness, it will have your entire house filled with the aroma of a nice 
Christmas sugar cookie, okay? So on Christmas morning, you're gonna open your gifts, you have your kids, your family, whoever. Light this Merry Cookie candle and you will see, you will get in the Christmas spirit. I also love pine candles and things like that, so I think I need to start stocking up on those tomorrow because I don't really have as many Christmassy candles as I thought. But Merry Cookie, as long as I have at least one or two Merry Cookie in my collection uh, during this time of year, I am A-OK. -okay. And I do that with Candle Day because you get them for like $9. And then if you have a coupon, girl, you're getting a hell of a discount, okay? Merry Cookie Notes are fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. It is so good. And I haven't found a candle yet that really just levels up and uh, compares to Merry Cookie. Surprisingly, we went through 12 candles, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and just, you know, here with me, y'all. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out how we gonna do this, okay? I want to be able to get a video up every day just to be on here talking with you guys. Every video is probably not gonna be long, you know, but with me, I can talk, so I can figure it out. Um, honestly, you guys, this was super fun. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you do like this type of video and um, this type of content, let me know in the comments down below. I have my wrapped in vanilla. You see, it's this is my sidekick. It's been sitting next to me all day. I've been reapplying, applying. I just, I just like the scent. It smells good. It just, it just smells really good to me. And um, I haven't used this body lotion yet. This is the Dream Bright from Bath & Body Works. I need to go somewhere. Somebody needs to take me out. I need to take myself out. And I picked this up today. Caring Bath Dove Almond Cream with Hibiscus, which I used to love so much. I don't know what happened to why I kind of stopped using it. And it kind of went on my nose. But thank you guys so much. Thank you for coming to the first day of Vlogmas 2022. Um, and again, comment down below. Let me know that you're here, that you're supporting me. I love you so very much. We're almost to 90,000 subscribers. Thank you so much. You guys are my family. I appreciate all the love and support. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at ash220 underscore and TikTok at livingash20 to stay updated with me on things outside of YouTube and all the good stuff that I have going on in my life. So Take care and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys.